Your first love. The one who got away. The one who broke your heart. Hi, I'm JT Tepnapa. And I'm Carlos Pedraza. We're embarking on our third feature film, a romance that follows two young men over the course of a dozen years. Something Like Summer is our adaptation of the acclaimed novel by Jay Bell, winner of the Lambda Literary Award, and Amazon named it one of its best books of 2011. We couldn't help but be drawn to the main character Ben Bentley and his struggles to find love when he was the only one out in high school. I was very popular in high school. You were a nerd, JT. Okay, yes, technically I was a nerd, but I was very popular with the boys. Score. Can I tell my story? Fine. I started hanging out with this athlete. He was very cute and very curious. We would give each other massages and play truth or dare. We would dare each other to eat hot sauce and eventually get naked. Uh, we had a four-year relationship, but we never called each other boyfriends. In school, he completely ignored me. It wasn't easy to be out back then. That's how something like Summer hooked me. My own experiences mirrored Ben and Tim's. I often wonder what it would be like if we met again, like in the story. Would he kiss me, or would he punch me in the face? Punch you in the face, clearly. Something like Summer struck a similar chord in so many readers. Wow. Brace you yourself just for a life-changing wow. story. It's amazing. It makes you believe in love. Absolutely beautiful. So, Carlos, who is yours? Come on, spill. Okay, fine. Fourth grade. Fourth grade? It must be in black and white. Really? It's more dramatical. Oh, and grainy! Fine. I totally stalked this new kid around school. He made friends with this girl I knew, so I maneuvered her into introducing us. He was a schemer even then. We became really good friends for a couple of grades, and then we kind of grew apart in junior high. But he was the cutest thing ever, in a kind of 1970s sort of way. 70s? Oh, that's in color! Still grainy, though. So, I guess I'm a little like Ben, too. I knew what I wanted and went after it. So that's my connection to something like Summer. Crowdfunding helped us produce our award-winning debut feature, Judas Kiss, and our new thriller, The Dark Place, coming out December 2nd. Something Like Summer is our first adaptation. So many fans of the novel are clamoring to see this movie on screen. And it's our most ambitious project yet, shot on more locations than we've ever used before, with seven musical numbers and featuring loads of original paintings by artist Kyle Johnson. So this is why we're launching an Indiegogo campaign. In a time of growing equality for LGBT adults, it's still hard for young people to come out. Many more are coming out earlier than ever and getting bullied at school. Even thrown out by their parents. It's hard to hold on to love when you're afraid all the time. Something like Summer inspires us to face that fear and be proud of who we are and claim the love we all deserve. So please, join us in our movie-making adventure. We've assembled a powerhouse cast. You can learn about them below. There's so much your support will do to make this a better movie. We're looking to raise $100,000, but that's just part of the budget. We're working really hard to raise the rest. Every dollar you give proves to investors that this movie needs to be made. Check out the great perks we're offering our backers. And please, share our link and our campaign videos with all your friends and your family. Share them with your neighbors, your coworkers, your internet provider. Ooh. Share them with anyone who wants to be a part of an inspiring love story. Thank you. Thank you.